In this video I will show how you can install the Ghost Rider mod that I created some time ago. This was my second mod. So it's not good in good in performance and has some bugs but is a good mod. Oh so let's download and save the file the this file here will be in the description of the video to help you download the mod. So after download finishes we will have this file here. Next let's extract to make easy to find the files. So inside the mod you will have this readme here which we will explain to you how to install which I will I will show to you how to do this. First, let's ins let's download the Ghost Rider badge model and the bike model. So let's go to this this and others here. And download the this mod this those models too. Those models was created by Keshus and Wopedel. So the download has finished. Let's extract it too. So Let's install the Ghost Rider badge because we won't replace Nico. We want to replace a single badge. In this case, I will replace my Ghost Rider mod, replace the multiplayer badge. So let's rename the models here to multiplayer and now let's open the open form let's pick the game version that we want to install click in edit mode yes confirm models cd mates component pads we will replace this model here. So let's use this name multiplayer to be replaced. Let's drag and drop to open for. And now here we have the Ghost Rider. Okay, now we have the, the Ghost Rider badge installed. Let's install the bike. The bike will replace the zombie B bike. So here in the open form, let's go to the root again. Let's open models, CD images, and let's open the vehicles.emg file. Now we will replace the zombie that is this bike here. You can do the same with that we did with the pad, just drag and drop. See, now this is the new zombie B bike. Okay, now we need to install one last thing, that is the chain model. The chain model will be the first pack that you downloaded, in the models to replace folder. Ghost Rider chain model by Webdel. This is the, the, the object that we replace, it's a brick. It is located at data maps generic proc object.emg. So here in the open for let's open data maps generic and proc object.emg. We replace the brick that is this one here. Let's drag and drop. 
and this is the new brick now it's a piece of chain okay so now we have our models installed the PDS, the Ghost Rider patch, the bike and the chain model now we need to install the mod itself here in the package we will see the mod folder inside it we must copy all files and paste into your GTA 4.exe folder as commonly it's here uh, this address here ok so let's paste it here and let's replace our files one important thing here is that this version of GTA it's with the patch 1.0.4.0 so I need to copy this delete here to GTA folder and replace the the old one. Otherwise the game will crash when loading. Okay, so we must do this step with patch 1.0.4.0 or lower. For other patches we just we don't need to do this step. Okay. So now let's test the mod. Okay, so here in the game, we to check if the script is okay to be using. You can press the quotes key, and you will see the name was Rider Script Mod by Judo Nibi. Okay, so if you press F4, you will become Ghost Rider. By default, you'll be with a shotgun. Very destructive gun. So to equip the the chain you press the number zero and the zero chain here will appear. If you use the attacks you can hold the hold the Iron Man menu up here. You hold the I'm I'm at the target and press for example or I at the target and press 1 I'm very lagged because of the the key 3 will will make you grab things with the chain so you, if you hold the I and press 3 the chain will grab pedestrians cars everything so you press 1 and it will throw the poor pedestrian against the target let's grab that pickup and let's throw it to the helicopter Oh, beautiful. Also, you can use the number the F5 to call your bike. So, you can use your bike to do a crazy drive with Ghost Rider on the streets. If you press control, it will do a jump with the bike. You can use just to help you use the wall ride feature. Yeah. 
you should have too much lag with this mod the some features don't will work fine it's a very cool mod I like it it's very interesting but as I said the performance isn't that good because this was my second mod I was learning how to script for GTA so probably you will find some difficulty using the, the, the features <laughs> this is very insane. So, this is it, people. How to install the Ghost Rider mod.